All righty, ladies and gentlemen, was reading some of that wrestling news. An AEW Battle of the Belts. The viewership came out, folks. Big special, I mean. You know, we were told before that it was a big special. Now that the ratings have come out, oh, this, this wasn't meant to be a big special. I mean, 704,000 viewers. Okay. According to the comments on Brian Alvarez's tweet, those are great numbers. Great numbers. Really, in what reality is this great number? You know what I mean? For a big special or whatever. So when they got promoted on the secondary network or whatever, on TBS, folks, you know, we got real content for the real network. Let's put this on the secondary channel. It's available in more homes. That's a, what you call a promotion, folks. Promotion. You know, when they went to TBS or whatever there, they were told they were going to get four major specials a year on TNT, boy. You know, they're no longer on the network because they got something better there. But you're going to get four big special a year. You know, this is the big time. Just like Clash of the Champions, folks. The quarterly special, like Saturday Night Main Event or whatever, you know. Clash of the Champions. Used to get millions of views. Okay. Saturday Night Main Event. A gazillion views or whatever there. This, not so much there. 700,000, you know what I mean. But are the AEW fans comparing this to what it was advertised that it was going to be a big special there? Like Clash of the Champion, Battle of the Belt. Clash of the Champions sound familiar, the name. It's meant to look like it's a big deal. You know what I mean? It was supposed to be. Maybe TNT decided, let's give these bitches just an hour or whatever. But it was supposed to be big. It was supposed to be. Okay. And it wasn't. It was trash. Okay. Now... The fans, they're not comparing it to a real show like that, obviously, because it's a fucking joke compared to Clash of the Champions, which is what it was supposed to be. Something serious like that. And it's a fucking joke, is what it was. So instead of comparing it to something that makes them look like complete shit there... What they're doing is they're comparing it to Rampage. Their one-hour throwaway show, which is the equivalent of WWE main event, you know. They thought it would be their SmackDown, sadly, but, uh, you know, it's their main event is what it is. So instead of comparing it to a big special, a big quarterly special like we've known them to be. Clash of Champion. They're comparing it to the worst show they have on television. It was better than Rampage. So the numbers are good. Are you serious? Comparing it to a failure of a show. A show that's known for being a fucking fail. With horrible numbers. Because you compare it to the war show on television, it's good. Because it's a little better than the war show of all time. It's a success. God damn, what a joke. You know what I mean? What a fucking joke. 
This was meant to be big. It's not supposed to be Rampage, right? It's supposed to be bigger than that. Fuck. You know. And. Fuck. I don't understand, folks. Really, they're like. I don't understand these fans. You know, because Rampage is on Friday. You know, they're treating it like it's supposed to be Rampage. It wasn't supposed to be Rampage, man. Oh, it's... It's uh, 700 for just a one-hour show. Hey! And on Saturday night? ho oh, ho Fuck you. You know what I mean. Straight up, fuck you. You know, don't compare it to Rampage. It was supposed to be bigger. We all know it's supposed to be bigger. But because it gets a little more than Rampage and it's on Saturday night, right? And, oh, it's a bad time slot. Just like Rampage is bad. So this is good. They have horrible number. Fuck you. Right? Saturday night main event was on Saturday, too. It got million. Clash of the champion. Got millions, you know what I mean. Friday night, WWE, two point something million, right? Oh, it was on Saturday, fuck off. Like, for real. Y'all are fucking pathetic. Like, it wasn't Rampage. It was supposed to be bigger than that, right? And they're using the fact that the show sucked. As an excuse to defend the show, for real. This was only an hour. It wasn't even a good show. The world champ wasn't even on the show. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Why not? It was supposed to be a big special. Why wasn't it a two-hour show? Like Clash of the Champion. Where the fuck was the world champ? It's called Battle of the Belt. The champ ain't there. Fuck is this? Oh, it's okay. It's... And they're acting like they're all high and mighty, eh? For a show that was worthless. They got good viewership. The champ wasn't even there. Shouldn't he be, though? Shouldn't he be? For a show called Battle of the Belt, shouldn't he be there? Fuck you. You know what I mean? Pathetic. I hate them so much. They're so fucking cheap. These fans, so petty, so fucking cheap, so delusional. I never seen a more dishonest bunch of fucking goofs in my entire life. The worst excuse I've seen. Oh, we were all so competing against Impact Wrestling pay per view. You know what? Oh, it's good for. Uh... Competing against some pack, you serious? They don't even get a hundred K or maybe they do a hundred K for the TV show on free TV. I'm sure millions ordered the pay-per-view. I'm sure of it. That must have took away the, the 300 K you were short to, to get a million. Fuck off. You know what I mean? These fans are fucking goofs straight up. The fucking weirdest bunch of fucking goofs of all time. Who is, who acts like this there? <laughs> Wasn't even a good show. And you're using that as an excuse. Fuck off. There, fuck you. Fuck you. You people are terrible. You're terrible. Fucking terrible. Straight up there. Until next time. Peace.